Uh, he was there the past weekend, watched Ante, Ante Joshua win his world title. How do you think his performance was? It's great, you know, there's, no, there's nothing really good. No uh, negatives you could uh, take away from that other than, you know, he did the job. The only negatives you could say was maybe his opponent didn't do something, but a good fighter makes their opponents you know, look bad. You know, I, every person I fight, before the fight, oh, the guy's got a chance, I knock him out, oh, he ain't never a chance, the guy was no good. You know, people said that about the last fight, you know, the guy had lost for 11 years. He promised a knockout. I went out there and knocked him out in one round. Didn't everyone? Nah, the guy was no good. If the guy would have took me six, seven rounds and really pushed me to the limit, then I said I was no good because I couldn't get him out in one round. So you kind of had to hide into nothing with the boxing fans. But as long as you keep knocking people out, and the, the big fights will come. Do you feel that you and Joshua are on a collision course together? Um, I believe so. Yeah, I believe that it's the fact. The, fight, the fights that make the big money are the fights that the fans genuinely want to see, and the fans at the moment want to see me and Joshua. So let them. Let them wait a couple of fights, and when that happens, it'll be absolutely mega. No problem, mate.